bow with me as we pray and we give thanks? Heavenly Father, tonight is a most special time, a reminder of how much we have to give thanks for really every day. These children and their pictures just remind us of the precious gift of life and of their lives and of your life in us. And we just can't thank you enough for that. We also want to thank you for the lives that come in here day in and day out and are extensions of your love to these babies through their hands and through their hearts. And I ask that you would bless each and every one of our staff who day in and day out are used by you to make a difference. Lord, we just thank you for these families, how you have sustained them, given them strength, shown them your faithfulness, and just given them the loves of their life and these little children. We ask that your purpose would continue to be fulfilled in their life. Heavenly Father, we thank you for the photographer, Allison, how her God-given talent has captured the very heart of these children. And their pictures that hang up there just can help us all on our hard days to be reminded of why we are here and the joy that we have in serving you by serving these little ones and their families. I can't tell you uh, what happened to me when I went up there today and I looked at every picture and I read every story. And there's no way I can explain my feelings as a used to be NICU nurse. And I know that the NICU nurses feel the same way. Um, there's no way you can go through that hallway without being touched. Uh, after I went through the hallway, I went to the NICU and I said, hey guys, what do you think? And immediately they came to me and they said, I can't believe this. This is wonderful. They said, I have chill bumps. I can't get through the hallway without thinking. These are things that we do every day. These are our success stories. And I remember when I was a NICU nurse, and as Anita said, I worked nights a long time, 12 years. And I can remember leaving that morning thinking, I couldn't give one more minute. I couldn't do one more thing to help that little sick baby. But you know, in the future, when our staff leave, they're going to walk down the hallway and they're going to look at those pictures and they're going to read the stories and they're going to say, you know what, I got it in me to do one more day, one more day for that baby. So I just wanted to say thank you for being a part of it. Allison, I can't say the words. It's just wonderful. So um, the way I look at it is, Gallery of Hope, priceless. created with an artistic vision and designed to give hope to our current families who desperately need it. I think you're going to be very impressed. I just keep saying uh, the only people that have really seen it are our NICU nurses and our staff as they uh, park their cars and enter. And uh, Every one of them have told me I'm just covered in chill bumps by the time I get down that hallway. express that reminder to us of what those three things are, that faith, hope, and love. I can't thank Allison, Rogers, and Jeff enough. They approach, uh, approached us last spring, and she said she was willing to donate her services, her resources, to take pictures, to take photographs, of our NICU graduates. And Allison's going to come up in a minute and talk more about her, how she was inspired by this vision. But needless to say, Allison, we're thrilled beyond words uh, over this project and how great it has turned out. We are extremely proud of our NICU, our level three uh, care, the staff members, and everyone. 
And this evening is, as Chris said, is all about hope and the bright future of our NICU graduates. And this will give our current families just so much inspiration so that they can get through the trials and tribulations that they face right now uh, as their child continues to grow. Please help me welcome Allison. Thank you. 